So hello guys, um, how are we doing? I hope we're doing well and I hope we're in the best of health. If not, hold on, no two days are the same. Today I am having a very special, very special um, featuring and today I'm going to show you some stuff that I grew up having, seeing them grow, but where I live currently do not allow me to grow them as much as I would love to. So thank you for joining us. This is Grow Earth. We really love dirt. That's why we're interested in growing earth. Right behind me here, we're looking at lemons. And let me walk you through some of the things that um, is just at hand reach at my family's yard. Let's grow and watch their garden grow. Follow me. So this lemon tree is really, really taller than me. I am absolutely taller than me. And the size lemon on here is ridiculous. As you can see, this is amazing, guys. And it's just like, if I can show you, it's falling to the ground. Look at that. Look at that. Look, look at that. My kids are excited. If you can hear their chattering in the background. But this is amazing. You gonna go get a lemon? Look at that. I just want that one pretty one. Daddy's gonna help you get that. So you like lemons? Yes, I'm gonna suck it. Why? Why you like lemons so much? Because it's tart. It's tart. Have you ever seen a lemon tree before? Um, yes. Okay, where? Here. Here. Here, yeah, right now. And um, I don't know if you guys know what kind of tree this is. This is an almond tree. I grew up eating raw almonds from a tree like this. This is almond tree. I am so excited. It's like I am back home. Okay, so these are the real size. Do you guys want one of this size or you want a big size? They eat a little piece of it. Vitamin C is inside of it, Conrad. Look at this. This is a mango tree. My son experiencing eating sugar cane. You gotta break it with your teeth. Go and bend your head and break. When you bite, you bend your head and you break it, okay? You put your teeth around it and then you come down. This right here is a tampering tree. This is amazing and this is a small tampering tree, but nevertheless, it is a tampering tree. And to the left of that is two different species of mango trees and we are here in the um in the Fort Myers area but this is beautiful so so beautiful I mean you can have a garden anywhere and your garden doesn't have to look a particular way your garden is the creativity of your mind the garden can be what you want it to be I'll be surprised if this is not an Aki tree. Wow, look at that. And this right here is an Aki tree. And this can go very large and be loaded, loaded with Aki tree, with Aki's. Wow. This is another mango tree coming. This looks like a lime tree. I'm gonna say this is a lime tree. Yes, it is. It looks a, a tad bit different. This is a lime tree. And this is, he's having a long, a long garden and he turns it like into a border. I am here looking at this. This was something that was started by a family member that won't be able to finish because I think this was a coup or is not in its completion because the time and the season has changed for him. I'm letting you know and I hate to be the person that's just jobbing you but I know the importance and I know you do too that you must get it started. You must do it. Come on. This is a jubilee tree and um, for those of us that are probably not um, Caribbean or we're not used to this one it gives like a like a meaty a meaty plum that has a very tart taste but look at this this is so so beautiful 
beautiful so beautiful so beautiful and his garden is being again like a border and he creates his garden to be like a border on the end i'm gonna go ahead and pick this this is a different type of mint guys this is a kneesberry tree <laughs> Nesberry, Kneesberry, and I don't know what is the scientific name for it, but this is amazing. Wow. 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 We used to, we used to get these. I have to show you these. When I grew up, we used to use these. We call them Spanish needles. And we used to get these, and we used to use them to shine our floor in Jamaica. I don't know if anybody else used to do that in Jamaica, but we used to do that in Jamaica. Check this mango seed growing. The seed is on the top right there, and it shoots out of the ground, and the seed is on top. Look, all right, so this palm tree here, a little coconut on here. Are you done to put it in the trash or come back? And this is the jewel palm that I'm telling you about. Did you pick one for me? Where's the merengue? This one. Yeah. This is the jewel plum. You gotta pick a high one. You're tall, Conrad. Use your height. Oh, they're dropping. Can you let me see what one looks like? Let me show them. So this is a jewel plum. Very nice. Shake it again. Shake, 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 shake. It's dropping to the ground. So this is jewel plum. And we get this from this tree. Look at this. Come around here. I'm going to put this one in my pocket. Right in my pocket. But, um, see? Oh, come on. Look at this right here. This is pear. What? Pear. So, so this is avocado. That's Jamaican pear. Yes. Jamaican avocado. Dad. Uh, this one is a mango tree. This is blacky. Okay. See the ackee's here. Oh. <laughs> Put the camera right up, right up. Come right here. I'm so excited. Can you see under it? That is amazing. Look at this little mango tree blossoming. Oh, so it stays short. Oh, okay. Oh, look at the backdrop of this red one. You see that? Right here? This is amazing. Well, watch out for poison ivy. They're this is killers. For poison ivy. What is this, Uncle Ruby? Brazilian cherry. Hello. Can I eat it? No, don't touch it. Oh. Is it poisonous? No, but it's beautiful. Yeah. Come this way. Looks like mistletoe. It looks like mistletoe. Look at this. Check this out. You see that up there? Check that out. That looks like a caterpillar. Devil caterpillar. Yeah. <laughs> With a lot of spice. And this is another almond tree. Oh, cashew. Is there one that I can eat? Is this the season for it? No, I don't see anything on it. This is a cashew tree. Look at that. Anything else? Yes, this is a nice little Oh, these are cassava. You, you don't know you have cassava flower? It comes from the root. This is a cassava, it's a root. Cassava tree. Like You're holding it. cassava tree. <laughs> oh, that's beautiful. Oh, that's the leaves of the cassava. This is the leaf of the cassava. That's what the leaf looks like. This tree right behind me is the famous moringa tree, and I am standing underneath a moringa tree. If you don't know about merengue, it is your homework. Go and find out. 
you need this tree and if you can't plant it you need to go ahead and buy the powder for merengue this tree mm -hmm. so guys right here i have um goban not gobanzo but pigeon peas otherwise known as So this is a yam tree and you have yam growing on the vines. Look at that. Oh my goodness, this way around two pounds. And we have over here, I believe, pineapple. And that's the life. Wow. This is pineapple. 